Krillin had a brief rivalry with Goku when they first met and trained under Master Roshi, but they quickly became lifelong friends. One of the most powerful and talented martial artists on earth, Krillin is courageous, faithful, and good-natured. He is a prominent Z fighter, despite usually being overpowered by the major enemies. His short stature and baldness, with the exception of when he grows out his hair in the Majin Buu saga onwards, although he occasionally shaves his head in several sagas in Dragon Ball Super, aids him in his ability to provide comic relief during those tense moments. During the later half of Dragon Ball Z, he largely retires from fighting, opting to settle down with his family instead, becoming the husband of Android 18 and the father of Marin. However, he returns to his lifestyle as a warrior later on in Dragon Ball Super. His appearance is quite memorable. Krillin does not have a visible nose. However, he seems to be able to smell until someone's mentioned it, like Goku during the 21st World Martial Arts Tournament. He smells the diamond Boma took from the pirate cave, and he smells the enticing trap mill in the mirror spaceship. In the Dragon Ball Adventure Special magazine, when asked why Krillin does not have a nose, Akira Toriyama responded, Krillin has a physical idiosocracy that allows him to breathe through his skin. Earlier on in the series and throughout the entire manga, Krillin had white eyes that were often squinty looking, giving off a bored expression. However, later on, his eyes are more open and the color of them seem to have disappeared completely, making the inside of his eyes the same color as his skin. Krillin is not naturally bald. Due to his original monostatic training, he merely shaves his head. During his training with Goku under Master Roshi, Krillin comments that all who aspire to master the martial arts shave their heads in order to unfeather their ki, and seems surprised to find out that Master Roshi was naturally bald. He also mentions that he waxes his head to keep himself bald. After settling down with his new family, his hair grows out, although his original smooth crown look is the most familiar to fans. The six dots on his forehead are scars from, from the burns that he received in his, his monk training. Let's just simplify that. Similar to the pattern that appears on the forehead of the Shaolin monks. Originally a jealous and selfish person, Krillin did not respect rules when confronted with Roshi's training. After a short arc between the two years later, Krillin even admits that he hated Goku at first. He becomes Goku's best friend and his selfish and jealous personality becomes more kind-hearted and generous, although he still has slight selfish and jealous traits after his reform. Krillin is often used as comic relief or canon fodder by the author. As most prominent full-blooded human characters in Dragon Ball series, Krillin also represents a sense of normalcy to Goku and Gohan, as well as often being the most identifiable. Often when things in the dragon world turn bizarre, it is left to Krillin to shake his head in disbelief and crack a joke. Despite his reputation as being a weakling compared to his Saiyan comrades, he is considered to be one of the strongest pure-blooded humans in the Dragon Ball series, being thousands of times stronger than the average person. In fact, he is well into the superhuman league. Although this is largely due to the fact that he was afforded much greater opportunities to increase his strength, such as gaining the ability to use Ki, training under Guardians of the Earth, and having his potential unlocked by Grander El Grand Elder Guru, things that no other human, such as Mr. Satan, ever had. Although he is not as strong as Goku or Gohan, his determination in helping his friends is a key asset. Furthermore, Krillin, Krillin ingenuity and talent for key manipulation is far superior than that of most warriors even those stronger than himself and he has an ability to sense hidden powers krillin had his dormant key awakened by the namek elder guru during the events of the namek saga although it is possible that not all, all of his power was free due to the fact that gohan still had more power then they both grew to be much stronger and this helped him among the same level as his more natural powerful friends, at least for a little while. 
Originally a monk of the Oran Temple, after training there for eight years, Krillin trained at the Oran Temple since he was four. He was the weakest student and was frequently bullied. When he was 13, he was getting tired of the bullying and began to travel to Master Roshi's Island when he was seeking training to surpass the people at the temple to defeat his bullies and to attract girls. All in all, Krillin is one of the most well-known characters in all of Dragon Ball. He's been there since the beginning and we've been able to witness his power grow. Everybody can take away a lesson from Krillin. Guys, if you like the content, subscribe to the channel. Don't forget to turn on the bell icon and share the video with as many people as possible. Till next time, thanks for watching. Have the best day you can.